students my sir suresh vs welcome back to my channel today we are going to start a new poem from your textbook hornbill the title of the poem is lebanon top written by ted hughes ted hughes was an english poet before going to the poem let us see what is the theme of the poem this poem symbolizes or it's a symbol of life and fluctuations or we can say that life that is a process of exchange and transformation so life a process of it's a process of exchange and transformation so that means people are active because they undergo exchange of energy so when we exchange the energy you see that we become active that's the theme of the poem now this poem is centered on a tree called laburnum tree and a bird named goldfinch and what is a laburnum tree laburnum tree is a short tree with hanging branches it has got a hanging branches you can see a uh, laburnum tree in india also okay so with the yellow flowers and also has got poisonous seeds its seeds are poisonous and goldfinch it's a small singing bird a small singing bird with a yellow feathers on its wings okay it has got a yellow yes feathers on its wings so it's looking yellow colored now let us go through the uh, yes the poem the lebanon top is silent quite still in the afternoon yellow september sunlight a few leaves yellowing all its sweets fallen till the goldfinch comes with a twitching chirrup a suddenness a startlement at a branch end then sleek as a lizard and alert and abrupt she enters the thickness and a machine starts up of chitterings and a tremor of wings and trillings the whole tree trembles and thrills it is the engine of her family she stalks it full then flirts out to a branch end showing her bad face identity mask then with a airy delicate whistle chirrup whisperings she launches away towards the infinite and the laburnum subsides to empty now let us see line by line okay see the laburnum top is silent the laburnum top that is the top of the tree that is very silent here the poetic device used that is personification a tree cannot be silent but here you see that there is no movement at all no noise at all it's calm and quiet without any movement quiet still still means rigid without any movement so it is quiet still there is no movement at all tree looks very silent as well as quiet and calm we can say without any movement when does it happen it happens in a september afternoon okay in a september afternoon so the poet looks at the tree in a september afternoon it looks very calm and quiet without any movement and not only that the sunlight you can see the sunlight there and in the sunlight it looks yellow in color that means the sunlight afternoon sunlight itself spread yellow color everywhere or the tree is surrounded by yellow colored light okay that comes from the sun a few leaves alone already you can see that a few leaves of the tree has become yellow in color why because the tree is going to shed its leaves from that we can say that it's autumn season so in an autumnal season on in an autumnal season we can see that the poets watches the yes watches the laburnum tree which looks very silent calm and quiet with its yellowish leaves as well as and it looks very beautiful with a yellow sunlight all its sweets fallen already all its sweets had fallen all the sweets of the tree were lying down it had fallen okay 
Now from this we can see that yellow color is used here often. It is the symbol of silence, death and beauty. Yellow color that is the symbol of silence and the, yes death and also beauty. So the silence of the tree has been transformed. As I told you that there is a transformation or there is a, a change. And when does it happen? With the coming of a, a bird called yes, goldfinch. So immediately a goldfinch comes. A goldfinch comes and perches on the branches of the tree. With that there happens a sudden changes, a transformation a transformation of energy the tree become very active okay so with a twitching yes chirap how does it comes with a twitching twitching means cure or jerk or small involuntary movements of the body so with a jerk with a shaking with an involuntary movements of the body you see that goldfinch comes and sit in one of the branches of the tree and chirrup. What is the meaning of chirrup? Sound made by the made by the bird. And it makes a sound there. That means it started singing. Okay. So you can see that the tree immediately, yes, the tree, the silent tree has changed. Sadness, suddenness. Suddenness means a sudden movement. There happens a sudden movement, a startlement or startlement what is the meaning of startlement amusement there is a complete yes movement a sudden movement and an amusement that happens there at a branch end so you can see that in a, in the tree there is a sudden movement a sudden movement happens until then it was very silent and uh, you see that there was a great excitement and amusement with the coming of the bird at a branch end, then sleek as a lizard. It comes and sits at the branches of the tree. From there, you see that it makes a smooth movement like a lizard. Sleek means a smooth. Sleek means, yes, smooth. It makes a smooth movement. Here, the poetic device used that is a simile because the bird has been compared to the movement of the, the bird's movement that has been compared to the movement of a, a lizard. You might have noticed the, how does the lizard moves? It moves smoothly. At the same time, it is, uh, yes, very alert and, uh, yes, abrupt. Abrupt means sudden. Okay? It's very alert. It's very careful. And it's very abrupt. This, it makes uh, some sudden movements. So, like of a lizard, the bird makes a very smooth, sudden, as well as a very cautious, careful movement. She enters the thickness. From there, you see that. Why does the bird make such a yes, careful movement? Because it, why it thinks that it should not be, the movement of the bird should not be noticed by its enemies. Or we can see that uh, any other animals like predators. Okay. Uh, why? Because she had already built her nest, yes, inside, in the thickness. Or we can say in the middle of the tree. What is there? Her nest is there. Her, her nestlings or her babies are waiting for her. She is coming with the food. So other animals, other predators should not watch it. So she is making a sudden, very vigilant and careful movement. So where does it end the thickness? The thickness that can be the middle of the tree where more branches are there, more leaves are there, coverings are there. So she enters there and a machine starts up. Immediately what happens like a machine. Okay, so there is a great noise as if a machine has been started. A great noise was there. You can see that what a startup there. Why? Because of the coming of the Yes, the mother bird, all her nestlings started to make a lot of noise. They are very much excited, very happy. And the whole tree, you see that it became, yes, noise, noisy. And the machine starts up. So we can say that the, yes, the tree with the, with the birds are the machines. And a chatterings of chitterings, 
What is stuttering? Stuttering means a singing sound of birds. All the birds you see that they started to sing together. The baby birds they started or the chicks started or we can say nestlings they started singing together. And the tremor of wings. Tremor means a shaking or we can say that a shiver. And they started to shiver their wings. That means a flapping of wings. The babies after seeing their mother they started flapping the wings. They are very much excited, very happy and they wanted to get food from yes their mother. So they are moving the wings and the trembles and the thrill sorry tremor of wings and trillings. What is the meaning of trillings? Singing repeatedly and all the birds they started singing repeatedly and you see that what a change happened there in the tree okay what a transformation the birds they were all together singing loudly the whole tree trembles and trills the whole tree trembles trembles means shakes okay trembles means shiver or shakes the whole tree that started shivering or shaking with thrills thrills means spirits great excitement the spirit there was a great excitement there was a great spirit with that the whole tree started shivering or trembling it is the engine of her family so the mother bird goldfinch is the engine of her family why because with the coming of her, with the engine only all other functions okay so the movement started with the coming of the goldfinch or we can say that that excitement and spirit all the movement happened there why because of the coming of uh, the golf finch so we can say that it is according to the poet the bird finch golf finch is the engine of her family and showing her bird sorry she stocks it full what is stocks it full stocks it full means add fuel she is adding fuel to the engine what is the fuel here? She is bringing food for the chicks and as a result of that they get the energy. So she is adding, yes, she is giving the happiness, she is giving the energy. So she is adding the fuel. As a result of that there is a, a great movement and afterwards then floods out after giving the energy, after adding the fuel and what does she do? Then floods out to a branch. Flirts means move abruptly. From there, she moves abruptly, suddenly to another branch of the tree. Okay, so to another branch end, and from there, showing her bad face. What is the meaning of bad? Bad means lined or having so many stripes. So showing her bad face, that is the identity mask. That means that is the identity of that bird. With that, we can identify that bird. Okay, so uh, showing her bad face or we can say lined face of the black masking of the uh, bird then with the airy delicate whistle then airy means uh, strange and mysterious with a strange and uh, mysterious noise or a whistling noise, whistling sound and chirrup whispering and she chirrups like in a very low voice like that of murmuring whispering means uh, murmuring she launches away launches means she flies away where does she go she goes towards the infinite infinite means the place without any yes boundary the here it is the sky she flies into the sky okay she may be going for in search of food for her uh, children and the laburnum subsides to empty then again the laburnum tree subsides, subsides means it diminishes or reduces to empty. That means, and it became silent again. It became calm and quiet again. Okay, it became calmer and quieter. So here you can see that the, with the, uh, the birds moving back or going back, you see that the tree became again very silent. Here you see that some other poetic devices used here. Silent, yes, September sunlight. Here you see that yes, sound that has constant sound that has been repeated. So it is alliteration. Then again, then sleek as a lizard, I told you, it's a simile. Okay, then machine starts up. 
here you see that it's a metaphor okay it's a metaphor then again the whole tree trembles and uh, trills this is also another metaphor used here then it is the engine of her family this is also a metaphor sorry the whole tree trembles and trills that is a personification and it is the engine of her family what is used here metaphor that is used here dear students i hope all of you understood this poem very well okay thank you for watching it so please like and subscribe my channel thank you thank you very much